I'm not still used to the cold here, but I... <laughs> but Ann Arbor is a very nice city to live in. I'm a faculty member in X department. Um, my area of research is RF and microwave circuits. Um, we work on a variety of topics from designing efficient power amplifiers to millimeter wave phase arrays. The end product, I guess, or end users are uh, cell phones and uh, communication systems and radars and sensors. In my laboratory, we have uh, microwave equipment, RF and microwave measurement equipment that can uh, measure uh, microwave networks up to 50 gigahertz. We have a network analyzer, we have a microwave transition analyzer, we have a 4 gigahertz oscilloscope, uh, we have a probe station, and we have several uh, wire bonding equipment to connect the chip to the circuit. So what I like about teaching is to connect the theory to more practical aspect of circuit design and talk about applications and where the circuits are used. One of my favorite courses that I teach is X411. That's um, introductory microwave circuit design course and we cover planar microwave circuits, both passive as well as active circuits. These days, you know, everybody uses iPods and iPhones and some sort of cell phone, smart cell phones, but often um, students are not aware of inner working of these devices. So what I like very much about the course is that students who take the class are, are very enthusiastic about learning the inside operation of these devices, how a transmitter works, how a receiver works, antennas, uh, what goes into designing uh, iPods and iPhones and personal communication systems. So connecting theory to actual practical devices that are used in everyday life and we often for, uh, take them for granted is, is, is very interesting and very enjoyable to teach.